Creating a component in an Altium 365 workspace is organized by component type. There are several methods to create components, including migrating a component, cloning a component, creating it yourself, and using a ready-made component from the Octopart database. You can create a new component using the Operations Create command in the right-click context menu in the Components panel. Select the type of new component. In the New Components tab, fill in the component name and description fields, its parameters, and attach models. To perform this operation, you can use data from the Octopart database, which greatly simplifies and speeds up the component creation process. Start entering the name and All Team Designer will offer the existing options in the database. The list will be reduced as you refine the name. Select a suggested option and all the necessary data will be taken from the Octopart database. Save the created component using the Save to Server menu command in the Projects panel. The created components are immediately available for use in the Components panel. The Altium 365 library has the function of cloning a component, which can be used when creating a new component similar to an existing one. Use the Operations Clone command. Make the necessary changes to the name, parameters, and models. We leave only the description field blank to see the automatic component verification provided by Altium 365. Save changes using the Save Current Documents as a new revision button. We immediately get a warning indicating the error. For a detailed description of the problem, see the Messages panel. Fix the error and repeat the save operation. The easiest way to create components is to load them from the Manufacturer Part Search panel. Select the component type and use the Context Menu command, Acquire. In just a few seconds, the component is loaded into your cloud library and ready for use.